Hey YouTube, this is Megan Phillips from Homeschool 101 and I have a special sneak peek for you today. I've been doing some curriculum planning lately. We just got our level three language arts from the good and the beautiful in. Uh, we're planning our next um, science unit, which is going to be marine biology. So I've been picking up some of the recommended read aloud books. That's also a unit from the good and the beautiful. But what I have today is not even out yet, but it's going to be out tomorrow. Um, this is musical multiplication from the good and the beautiful. This is going to be released early. It's gonna to release tomorrow, which is Tuesday, April 16th at 9 a.m. Um, this set is gonna be $24.99, and that includes two things. It includes the download of all of the songs, which is on four tracks, and I'll explain that here in just a second, and then it includes either the physical copies of the book or there's gonna be a PDF option for these books, which I know is super important for some of you, especially if you are an international customer, because um, I know shipping can get really expensive and stuff sometimes. So they have said that there will be a PDF of the books. So this is the little set. It comes in this little box. Um, and in this set, there are four books and there's a little instruction card at the beginning. And so this kind of gives you some really simple instructions. Basically what you're going to do is you're gonna work one set at a time. So you have A, B, C, and D. So you're gonna work one set at a time. Um, your kiddos can listen to this in the car while they're working on other things, while they're emptying the dishwasher perhaps. But ideally you would want them to be able to look through the little flip book while they're listening to the song. So they're gonna to listen to the song and they're gonna be looking at the picture that corresponds with that. This set covers multiplication tables for threes, fours, fives, six, seven, eight, nine, and 12. Um, twos are usually pretty easy for kids because they're just doubling and then tens and elevens are easy to learn as well. So they're focusing on the ones that are more challenging. So they're gonna to listen to the song. They're gonna flip through the little flip book as they're listening. Um, another thing to note is that this one is five times three is 15. There's, no, there's only a song for five times three is 15, not three times five because they're reversible. So there's only a song for each of those. So they're gonna listen to the song. Then when they get to the end of that track, each song is about five minutes long. Then in the back, there are flashcards, which start right here on these green pages. We have not even cut ours out yet, but you'll cut along the dotted line. And then your child can quiz themselves. Three times three is, and then the answer will be on the back. Okay, so you're gonna work one set at a time until your child has mastered this set. Um, so anywhere from one to three times a day for them to kind of listen through to the songs. Once they can go through these flashcards without hesitation and they know all of them, where do the flashcards start? Right here. Then it's considered mastered, then you can move on to set B, okay? So there's four different sets in here. I showed you some of the pictures these are kind of the typical pictures that you would expect from the good and the beautiful. Um, they're bright and colorful and they're fun and they're gonna go along with each of, each of the sets, okay? So that's what you're gonna get is the four books plus the songs. The songs are currently only available for download, which is how it is typically with all music from the good and the beautiful. So I've done two things. Um, I downloaded them on my computer as soon as the zip file came through. I put them on my computer. Um, I also downloaded them on my phone through my Google Drive. And I'm using my phone right now to film. So I'm gonna try and take a screenshot and maybe hopefully I can put that in the video somewhere so you can see what it looks like. I just have all four tracks. So that way I can play them um, on my, through my car stereo while we're driving or one of my kids can just take my phone and go listen to the songs and then come back. Um, depending on how tech savvy you are, I know some people wanna have them on CD, you should be able to burn them onto a CD if you wanna be able to put them in your car or something like that as well. So you would have those different kinds of options. So what we're gonna do next, I think, is go into our office and I'm going to let my third grader listen to just part of a song so you can kind of hear how the music goes and see that and then we'll kind of wrap up and give you an idea of what we think. Um, obviously we just got these, so we will do a follow up after a while and see how he's liking them um, and if it's been easier for the math facts to stick. We've been using a combination for my third grader that's learned multiplication of Matthew C teaching textbooks and just a tiny little bit, we're just adding in some of the mathematical reasoning. So that's kind of his basis for learning multiplication. So we will uh, transition to our office and we will be right back. 
Okay, we are in our office and uh, we are getting ready to move. So you're going to have to kind of excuse the mess in here. But this is, I just happen to have a third grader. This is my oldest. And um, so he's going to listen to just the first couple of um, songs so that you can kind of hear what it sounds like. And he'll kind of show the pictures so that you can see what they look like. Um, so each fact pair, so like the first one is three times three is nine. It's sung through three times. So they do the three times three is nine. Um, and then on the last one, the answer is blank. So that's where your child can kind of fill in the answer. They can sing through obviously the whole thing, but that blank is there to kind of really help them. So um, what Andrew is going to do is he's going to start and we're just going to listen and hopefully the volume will be okay. Um, but we'll go through a couple of tracks and then we'll, we'll let you know what we think. So Andrew, whenever you are ready, you can do that. Good job. Okay, six go ahead. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, fin go ahead and finish the song. I didn't count. Dad has to okay, now you can pause it. Thanks. Sorry, that was my fault. I didn't count yeah. to three. Um, so that's what the songs sound like. You would go through the whole book. So again, you're going to master set A before you move on. So Andrew, go ahead and flip to the flashcard page so they can I'm kind sure of see that one. last one. Pages. Yep. On the instruction card, it tells you the order that the facts are presented in, if you're curious. So there's the last page with the flashcard. So that Andrew, you would go, you would say three times three is? Nine. Okay. So, and then six times six is? 36. And the answers are on the back. So they can go ahead and flip through. I think what we will probably do is, since he knows a lot of his facts and we're just kind of helping to solidify and make them get mastery uh we'll probably at least go through the book one time a day and then hopefully he can listen to the songs maybe a couple other times which is part of the reason i put them on my phone so like in a little bit when we run up to the post office i'll just play through a um then he hears it and also my seven-year-old hears it as well and so it will kind of start getting them in her brain she listens and learns really well through music so i'm hoping she'll pick it up just watching andrew go through it so what are your do you have an initial thought here real quick andrew as we end so far, I like it. Yep. I mean, it's kind of how it all starts. Yep. <laughs> so it's nice and nice and simple, and it's small and compact, which is something that I like as well. So we will um, give you an update once he's been. Maybe once we've gotten through set A, we'll kind of let you know how long it took for us to master that and what we kind of ended up. Um, so he's showing you there's B. Just hold up the front so they can kind of see each one. Couple all four each. sets of those so again those are going to be releasing on um, April 16th so by the time you see this video they should already be available on the website in PDF format or you can get the physical books the CDs or the songs again are always going to be on download and the set is going to retail for $24.99 so if you have questions uh, please leave them in the comments below you can always give us a thumbs up. We appreciate that or subscribe to our channel. We are hoping to get back into the swing of videos and give you guys some updates once we get moved and settled um, and life is somewhat back to normal. So we appreciate you guys sticking around. And as always, thanks for watching. Andrew, you want to tell them bye and happy homeschooling.